we're talking to somebody about corporate finance, we really say we deal with decisions associated with what assets the company wants to own and where they're going to get the money to be able to buy those assets. As a finance professional, you really have to know your accounting, data analytics, statistics, strategic management, marketing management, people management. The reason I like finance is that it made all those other topics that I took in my MBA program make sense. A huge thing I've learned just from the different courses I've taken is data analysis. How to be given a ton of data and you know what do you do with it, how do you extract information, and then how do you make business decisions. Your GPA is important, but things that also help you get that job are activities where you're involved in case competition, involved with other students on teams, doing some sort of project. I was kind of a late bloomer when it came to truly being involved on campus, and I'm incredibly happy that I join these organizations. One in particular would be Consult Your Community. What I found is I could not only you know, work with other students that I'd never met before, but also perform real service for local businesses. And it really gave me an understanding on what the industry of consulting was like. I think by joining clubs like that, it just gives you a community within your community. Post-graduation, my plan is to work for Deloitte as a strategy analyst and their consulting practice. I solve different business problems uh, that are given with me in like a three to six month time. And I really wanna do that because it'll kind of sharpen what I know about business to maybe one day go back to grad school, meet other like, like-minded uh, people, and either start my own business or continue in the industry I'm in or pivot into a new one. Get busy reading the Wall Street Journal, reading Barron's, uh, listening to the financial news. One of the things I've always liked about finance is you could teach it right off the front page of the Wall Street Journal 365 days a year. In other words, it's everywhere and it's constant. Just read that stuff and you'll be ready.